Hey, how's it going? Uh, just a real quick one today. I've been messing about with these uh, small stepper motors. Basically, I bought like a pack on eBay a few months ago. Just there's a couple of different types out there you can find. Um, what did I get made up? Yeah, I got some PCBs made up. Um, you can find the link in the description below to a GitHub if you want to make them up. Basically, it's just a footprint. It's got four, you know, holes in each corner, and it's linked back to a basically just a breakout in the middle so you can drive it using a, a motor driver like I've got on this breadboard here. Uh, yeah, I was just interested to see if it could actually push, you know, make a small robot using them. Um, I'll just plug these in here so you can see. They have a surprising amount of torque, you know, it's actually pretty good. I've just got some paper wheels here. You can see if I push it back, it does actually kind of move on its own. It's a, uh, the wires actually do affect it. It's such a small, like a light force that um, it's kind of hard to tell, but it basically, if I put the breadboard over it and the wires there, it does move on its own. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I'm gonna just drop you down here. Yep. I'm not gonna edit this either, so apologies in advance. That's it, it's pretty cool. I'll just speed it up here for a sec so we can see what that looks like. Yeah, so we can go at a fair speed. You can see the one on the left here isn't working. I'm just having a bit of bother with the breadboard. The wires are so thin that it's sometimes they don't make contact and stuff, but oh, there we go. Uh, yeah, and the wheels are just made out of paper i didn't have anything else to hand but i think if you 3d printed the wheels uh you know had a small lipo battery small microcontroller uh motor driver chip you know and you could even put on the bottom you could even put like a small infrared uh led and a receiver and detect you know black lines and stuff and drive about so yeah basically i'm just gonna keep ticking away projects on github you can see there it's called microbot so yeah, let's see what happens.